Hi, my name is Ron, and I am a supportive husband. Um, my wife is uh, was diagnosed two years ago with Parkinson's, and um, she had had suspicions of what it was. And uh, when we got to the movement specialist, um, and he says, "What do you think it? What do you think it is?" And she said, "I think it's Parkinson's." He said, "I think you're right." And so uh, we got a confirmation when she started taking the medicine. And uh, one of the first things that uh, I discovered was the confirmation um, caused her emotionally um, to kind of break down from time to time. I found her crying. And so um, the most important thing for me at that point um, was to help her emotionally. Physically, she's in you know really good shape, but emotionally, uh, that's what I was concerned about. And so um, we uh, we had an opportunity to attend uh, a little get together at Vanderbilt, and met some people from the support group down in Franklin. And we started to I started going to that meeting. Sharon was still working, and uh, my concern was that a person with Parkinson's. Um, Feel, may feel very um, isolated and alone. And even as a, a supportive husband, I don't know what she's feeling. And she gets a reminder four times a day when her medicine runs out. And so I tried to, I tried to feel what she was feeling, but of course I can't do that because I don't have Parkinson's. So I wanted to find a support group other people that she could identify with and fortunately uh, it's a great group of people and it was nothing like I thought um, I, I thought it might be you know this little group of uh, people complaining but that's not what it was at all what it was was uh, very educational and a very open environment where people could d discuss openly the things that they were feeling and so it was like finding home for her. Anyway, that's all I have to say.